If you have a sweet tooth, you may consider backing away from the cookies and candy. New UAB research at the cellular level shows calories and glucose speed the growth of cancer cells. If we can reduce the number of, of calories that we receive, then we're going to live longer and we will be at less risk for developing cancer. In a first-of-its-kind study, UAB biology researchers have studied the effects of calorie restriction in human cells, first focusing on healthy cells. And we found that when these cells received less nutrients, for example, less glucose, that they lived longer. They, uh, the cells divide longer and they were healthier in the culture. Researchers also looked at calorie restriction in unhealthy cells capable of becoming cancerous. Those cells had just the opposite effect of the normal cells in that caloric restriction decreased the lifespan of the cells and actually induced many of these precancerous cells to die. Previous calorie restriction research had only been conducted at the organism level on laboratory animals. UAB's research is a breakthrough with its focus on cellular effects. But this is the first time in our lab we find that uh, in cell system, we find that glucose restriction or caloric restriction can indeed extend the lifespan of the cell culture. Our discovery that these uh, caloric restriction effects apply to the individual cells is highly significant because we know that aging works mostly at the cellular level. And having a better understanding of the influences of aging could open the door to fighting aging-related diseases like cancer and Alzheimer's.